<gasps> they're both over there. I swear they're like, who's it gonna be? I gotta walk through all that mud to get to them. Denver! <laughs> get your head out of that brown bale. Come here. Come here. The wrong one came. <laughs> it's not you. I can't fit on you. <laughs> Come here, oh gosh. He's coming. Oh my gosh. These are gonna be Storm and Finn's friends soon. Come on! Come on! <laughs> Aww, what a good boy! Where's that imaginary duct tape? <laughs> Thank you. No. <laughs> Only if you're not doing it when I'm talking. Tonight we are running on the right track I know we never gonna look back Oh, I just wanna have a good time Call me whatever Cause I'm up for anything like that Oh no, we don't wanna do slow mo So tonight we just let go To the beat and treat every hour Sing like and push him over with your inside leg when he does that. Circle one more time. You're getting a little strung out there in the middle. Eyes on F. Look and turn. F. F. For fish. Look at F. For fish. You're looking in the wrong direction. If you're riding a circle, you're going to be looking at a letter on your circle. I'm going to stop. Then you're like, uh-oh. Turn right. Turn right. Turn right. You can still turn right. That is left. You are not that dyslexic. Trot on. Is that where you get it from, Gabby? Yeah. <laughs> it's on camera. Must be true. He does that to scare Sophia and it works. He doesn't actually do anything, he just hops his butt sideways. And we're gonna try that circle again. Sure. F is over here. Yeah. Look at F. Turn his nose. Pull his nose to F. Pull. Yay! That was a better circle. Now you're gonna go around the arena. Your feet look lovely, by the way. Oh, this course is just ridiculous. You're gonna trot up over your trot pole. Oh, yeah. I think people are calling me from the United States. Well, don't answer. Yeah, my phone's in the car. Is it gonna be long distance? Look up, keep rising. Good job. He's jumping? No, he's putting his feet up really high. He's animated. Can I have a rest? No. Can you do it one more time and then have a rest? Come on, do the poles one more time. Nothing. You did full laughter when we got him in trouble. Getting better. Look up. Pass him up. Squeeze your reins. Good job. Keep going past us. Go past us. Don't stop at the gate. All right, now you may walk. Can I go over there and talk? <laughs> All this time I thought I was teaching you to go over. You know, every time you ask me what you're doing wrong and 
I tell you you're just fine? You just need to sit up and ride? Yeah. Because he does his job so you can do yours. No, you're good. You're like, okay, sit up now, get right. Change your right. He can slow down a little bit. He's a little bit of a food train. There you go. So I awesome. started riding faster and he stood up just like he's supposed to work. That's right. And you slow down and he slows down, right? Shorten your reins a little bit. That's a better pace. You're going to want to shorten your reins a lot more because we're going to weave the pylon. Shorten them up. Good. Looking up. Eyes on the last pylon. So, do you know why you missed one? I didn't see her. You were going a little too quick, and you made your weave too wide. Stay closer to the pylon so it's more of a straight line with little blips. This part is so true. No matter what you're telling me, listen. You're doing it again. There you go. Stay close to the pylon. Close to the pylon. Closer. Closer. Yes! Change your eyes. Try again. There you go. What's better? Let's do it again. Slow them down. So when you get halfway through, you need to ask them to slow down a little bit. Slow them down a little bit. Stay close to your cones. Whoop. Good. Look up. Lean back. That's okay. And go right. Excellent. Sit for two. You have to be trotting to sit for two. You're good. Hands together and forward. Let's try the pylons again. They're not easy, are they? No. Look at the last cone in the row. How straight can you go? How straight can you go? Very little turning. There you go. Sit for two. Try again. No, no. Get on the rail. Try to sit for two again is what I meant. Run away, horse. Who's drunk? The rider or the horse? <laughs> I feel like it's not the horse. The horse is picking up his feet, so he's obviously not drunk. Right? Starting on the rack. <laughs> Keep them on the wall. Lift your hands up a little bit out of your crotch in front of your belly button. We're going too fast. So ride straight with your body and post properly. Squeeze. There, now look up where you want to go. Good. Now turn your whole body. Go straight on the rail. Staying on the rail. Staying on the rail. Uh -oh. Left leg. It's okay. Stay rising. When you go, uh-oh, you just start flopping in the saddle. Don't stop when it gets icky. You have to learn to ride through that. He's trying to go back. Then half halt and keep rising. Believe me, it's not easy to get this horse to canter. You will not be cantering. If he will not go into a canter. You just trot around the ring like an idiot. Stay on the wall. Just turn your body a little bit. Turn your eyes. Little half halt with your fingers and breathe. Lift your hands up and half halt. Up and half halt. Don't bury them in your crotch. Lift them higher. Off of his neck. And pull back. There you go. When you pull down, your body leans forward. When you pull up and back, your body sits on top of him. Like no. you're stacked. 
So what was he doing that's different? He's speeding up on you. Okay. You got a lot of legs, so he's going. Okay. That's what I like. You're also leaving your hands on his neck and falling forward and just letting him do whatever the heck he wants. So lift your hands up in front of your belly button. Front on. Change your eyes. Good. Keep your hands there. Now just breathe and half halt. Keep rising. Half halt, half halt, half halt. Good. Don't stop. Looks like Denver is But then he stops up here. He's playing games with your mom. Change your eyes. Change your eyes. Try again. Good. Half halt. Release. Half halt. Yes, go. Look up. You got it. Half halt. Release. Yes, you controlled it that time. Don't let him stop here. Inside leg. Inside leg pushes belly out. Good. Half halt. Release. Half halt. Release. Inside leg pushes belly out and half hold. Keep rising, keep rising. Come on, Laura, you got this. Don't stop. Change your rise. Excellent. Weave the pylon. It's fine. Look up. Keep them nice and close. Just a straight line with a little blip. Half hold. Half hold. Half halt, look up. You're good. You're very good. That's better. Half halt. Good, keep rising past us. Look up, when you get to the mirror, you may walk. Half halt. Sit and walk. Good job. And you didn't complain through any of that. <laughs> Not laps, just like a circle each direction. Where's the fun in doing what you're told? I don't mind even though I lose control. Better than you like Center. Tanner? There. Lift your hands up. Go large. Don't go circle. Go straight. Hey, that's it. Keep going. You got it. You got it. There you go. Lift your inside leg up. Good girl. Keep Tanner until he gives you a nice Tanner. He's got to learn. Then he doesn't get to go fast or stop. He has to learn that he's going to do this until he gives you a nice canner. Because what he used to get was, okay, we're done, right? You're going to canner fast like an idiot, we're going to let you off. There's no reward here. The reward is when he came here tonight. There's a good boy. Talk to him. There, breathe easy. Oh my good boy, and walk on that because that was lovely. 
He earned his walk. Keep him walking. was a bit of a nightmare. Literally, best ride of my life, you guys. I, I just want to tell you guys everything that happened. Like All along, people said, it's never the horse, it's always you, but I had never been riding the horse that I needed to teach me. He, he is a schoolmaster. He is, oh man. And it's not just his skill. He's forward and and, it, and responsive and a gentle giant. But it's not just that, you guys. It's his personality. He's calling me. All right, he's calling for his friend, but still felt like it was calling me. He was calling me. He, he, he's so personable, so friendly, so loving. I feel like he could bond with anybody. I feel like he's the kind of horse that's like, yeah, I love you because you're here right now. And then goes to the next person and loves them just as much. Like, and he knows stuff. Like, he's skilled. That horse has got some skills. I feel like I rode better than I've ever ridden in my life. I felt like I could work on me. And I feel like all the times that I was listening and trying to do it, I was actually picking it up. I just couldn't prove it. But I could prove it on him. I love him. I might learn to ride this winter. I might learn to ride. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.